There are three variations within the deadline roll cast. One is your standard straightforward roll cast. From there to there, we throw the line into the air and let it settle on the water. The next is a roll cast pickup. This adds enormously to the efficiency of your fishing. Into the air, back cast, and I could change direction from there. You can do all sorts of things. It's a very quiet pickup off the water. So roll cast back, and then the forward cast simply goes into the air, and then we go into our back cast and put it down. The next variation is a roll cast with a waterhall pickup. And this is a cast that we use for getting sink tip lines and heavy flies to the surface. And it looks like this. And I'm, in a second, I'm going to put a sink tip line on with a big heavy fly on and show you how it's done. But the, the roll cast pickup with a roll cast with a waterhall pickup, I'm just going to straighten that out again, looks like this. Come back to here, roll it out, it lands on the water, I pick it up and then make a forward cast. Okay, so that's a roll cast with a waterhall pickup. I'll do that again. Back to here, D-loop, anchor, roll it onto the water, pick up, and shoot. So with a sink tip line and a big fly, it looks like this. So I'm going to demonstrate when we would use the roll cast with a water haul pickup. So a lot of the times when we're fishing the snags, there we go, there's a snag over there. Put the cast in, you've got to let the fly sink. There's a lot of situations where the fly sinks. This is equally as applicable to a couple of beadhead nymphs, tungsten nymphs or heavy streamers, even on floating lines. Okay, so I'm going to let that sink, strip it back in. Now, in, for best casting efficiency, it's, it's probably best that I don't strip this all the way back into the boat. A few weed beds down there. I'm going to go into a roll cast position, roll it out, water haul pick up, and shoot. It's incredibly efficient. I'm going to do that again. So let that sink. There we are. Now, here we go. Back into the roll cast position. Roll cast it out onto the water. Pick up and shoot. So that's a roll cast with a water haul pickup. It's different to the standard roll cast pickup. Okay, you let it hit the water and then you pull it off the water. Makes for wonderful fishing efficiency. Um, I, I use it in many, many situations. Now, if you've got, say, a really heavy fly, I'll put a bit more line out there, a really heavy fly and a super fast sink tip or even a super fast sinking shooting head, you may need to give that a couple of rolls to get that up to the surface. Now it's up, now it's straightened out, pick up and shoot. Okay, so I'll do that again. Strip it back in, let's say that's sunk, let's say I'm fishing fishing 20, 30 feet of water, sunk right down, strip it in. I don't want to bring the fly all the way back into the boat. This even works uh, when you're lock styling with sinking flies. You get it in, you can see the fly out there, you've got a 10 foot rod. Just do a roll cast onto the water, then go into your back cast and shoot it out. So here we go. Lift this, it's catching in the weeds there. So I let that sink a long way. It's got a big chunk of weed on the end of it. It's going to make it even more interesting. There it goes. A couple of roll cars to get it to the surface and shoot. Makes for incredible fishing efficiency. It's the roll cast with the water haul pickup. Mm -hmm.